chance to make it count for something. Hello everyone, great day. I am Elizabeth Augustine. I am here to speak about my ambition for my country. Before I talk about my ambition for my country, I would like to start with what makes my country special to me and why I like to do something for it. I admire my country for its rich culture and traditions and believe in its slogan, Unity in Diversity. When it gained its independence, India was like a storehouse of problems. In spite of all this, India has made a marvelous progress in various fields like agriculture, space, medicine and so on. All these achievements make me proud to say that India is an emerging global scientific and technological superpower. Though I see a huge progress in various fields of our country, I feel there is a more to do. When I say this, I want to talk about two major fields of our country which needs importance, agriculture and education. Since long, I have a question. Why should farmers suffer? We don't exist without them. Though the government is introducing many schemes, they are still committing suicides and holding protest. Nobel Prize winner Kailash Satyarthi once said, there is no greater violence than to deny the dreams of our children. I dream for an education system in our country where grades no longer decides a child's ability but his innovation does. I dream for a system in our country where fields apart from engineering and medicine are explored. At the end of the day, I wish for a system where every child is allowed to dream, to fly to their ambitious, happy life. When you accomplish something, it's about what you do with your accomplishments. My country has taught me humanity, kindness, and love. Today, I take an oath to stand with my country and give back people what it has taught me and do my best to make my country incredible in India. Finally, I conclude my words with saying that my heart is filled with immense pride when I say that I live in India and India is my country. Thank you all. Jai Hind.